In blackjack, everyone's goal at the table is to beat the dealer's hand by getting as close to 21 as possible. Everyone who does wins. If you go over or bust, you lose the hand. Highest winning hand possible is blackjack, which is a 10 value card and an ace as the first two cards you're dealt. After bets are placed, the dealer will deal each player two cards, both facing up. Here's something you'll need to know. Cards two through 10 are taken at face value. Face cards, jacks, queens, and kings are each worth 10, and aces are worth one or 11, depending on how you want to use them. Now to playing blackjack. Blackjack is a game of strategy, and by applying it, you can improve your odds of winning. It can help you with decisions on whether to hit, stay, split, or double down. We'll explain these actions in a moment. Remember, you can always ask your dealer as you play, or go to playsmart.ca to learn more blackjack strategy. If you have an eight and a king, that's 18, pretty close to 21. The odds suggest that you stay. Let's get back to aces and explain how they work. Let's say you have a 16 in your hand, and using basic strategy, you decide to hit to get another card, and you get an ace. Knowing that the ace has two values, counting it as 11 would put you over 21 or bust your hand, which means you lose the round. Instead, by assigning a value of one, you'll have 17 and still have a pretty good chance of winning. Now, if the dealer gets blackjack right off the bat, then everybody automatically loses. Unless, of course, the other players have blackjack. If this happens, they keep their bets. Actually, anytime a player ties the dealer, they get to keep their bets. Now let's talk about hitting. After the initial deal, players can ask for an extra card, say, if they have a 10 or less. To hit, you would do this. Let's say you have 17 or over and you're satisfied with your total. You would want to stay. To stay, you would go like this. That means no more cards. If you have a pair, like eights, you may want to split them. You indicate you want to split by doing this. Splitting your hand gives you a better chance to win as you are now playing two hands. But keep in mind, it forces you to double your bet. Finally, there's another play called doubling down. After you've been dealt your first two cards, you have an option of doubling your initial bet, but you only get one additional card. The best time to double down is when the dealer is showing a bust card, typically a five or a six. This is because there's a pretty good chance the dealer's other card is a 10 or face card, increasing the odds that the dealer will bust on their next draw. Blackjack is super fun, and unlike a lot of other games, it requires decision-making that can impact the outcome. But at the end of the day, it's all up to the cards. Now that you're up to speed on the basics, it's time to have fun and play smart.